Hello, Karen Wolf here. I am going to paint an Easter Bunny on this board. I've had this thing forever. I had my husband to make it. And I just want to paint a bunny on it. So that's what we're going to do. <laughs> so I don't know what you guys are doing today, but I'm painting a bunny rabbit. So, how are you doing? Hey, Tina. Y'all say hey when you come on here and uh, let me know. Let me know where you're, where you're uh, from and where you're jumping on here from and your name so I know what's going on. So I'm just painting this on here. Um, just kind of on a whim. Not really. I'm going to get me some more white paint out here. Not really uh, sure. I'm kind of going by the, the bunny rabbit that I posted. Um... Just gonna get him on here. But this is just a board. Um, my husband had uh, cut something. I don't know what. He's all the time doing something. Uh, but he had cut a board, and uh, several of them. And they were just in here in my art studio. And one day I said, uh, take these boards and nail them together. So, hey Brenda. Uh, but it's just, you know, y'all ever do that? <laughs> Tell your husband don't throw nothing away because you want to make something out of it. I do. I, uh, I'm just taking some brown and some white and just painting in some, uh, Easter bunny color here. Just putting an Easter bunny in here. Um, but I told him, I said, don't throw that away. Uh, and I put it in here in the art studio forever. And um, one day I said, nail these things together because I want to, kept seeing people painting on them. I said, nail these things together because I want to paint something on here. And he said, well, what are you going to paint? And I said, I don't know. So today I'm decided I'm going to paint a bunny rabbit on it. And what I'm going to do... I'm just taking brown and white and painting in a bunny shape. That's all I'm doing with a wore out one inch brush. Um, but what I want to do is, uh, I don't have any right now. And I'll come back one and show you guys later. Uh, I'm going to stencil something on it up here. So I thought that would be cute. Like, you know, Happy Easter or... You know, hello Easter or something to that effect. This part right here is real rough and it needed to be sand, sanded probably, but I'm going to paint over it. <clears throat> I need to move you guys up farther, up closer. Probably a little bit blurry and dizzy. Y'all getting dizzy? It does that. It like blurs in and out. See, you can see that. Can y'all see that? That better? There we go. Now it'll probably blur in and out when I stick my hand in there. But I, what I'm doing is I'm just taking a brown, a sienna that I had on. I had this plate. I've, I've been painting this morning. And uh, I'm just taking this sienna, which is a brown. And I'm just painting it down here as my, my dark. I'll paint some sienna over here as my dark. And like I said, his face right here is a, a rough spot in the board. And if you have something like that, you can uh, sand it down. I didn't. Um, but all this is is five pieces of wood. And uh, Joe, uh, my husband, nailed them together for me. And I, he, I told him. He's real neat about stuff. And I told him, I said, don't worry about making it all neat. Because they were all uneven lengths and stuff like that. And I said, don't worry about that. <laughs> and he, of course, can't stand it and makes them all matchy-matchy and all that. But uh, I wasn't worried about it. So I'm just making that all. Uh, gosh, I just went through all that white. And then I'm just going to go over here on this side. 
and I'm just taking white on that dirty brush. But don't be afraid to just do stuff like that. Don't be afraid to paint. Do you all do that? Do you all just take stuff and, hey, Paula, just um, throw something together, nail some boards together. and They've been selling these, though. Um, I was over at Walmart the other day getting some supplies, and uh, they had some something like that over at the Walmart. Have you all seen them? I think they called them uh, pallets or something. I guess they're like the pallet boards. So I'm just painting in this some white over here on this side. And this is just going to be kind of, and I keep getting into the blue, but I don't care. I do not care about that. Keep getting into the blue. Well, hello, Elaine. Um, I, um... I'm not worried too much about that because if I put some blue in the background, then that'll just make it all match. So I'm just going to go back in where I got a little bit more white on there than I wanted. I'm just going to go back through. So there's that. All right, so there's my bunny. I'm going to rinse my brush. I should have got me some clean water before I started. <clears throat> But I didn't. I just was in a hurry. Not really. I painted um, painted a couple videos today and had some time on my hands here for a few minutes. And I thought, well, I hadn't painted anything for a while for you guys. Oh, I painted the dinosaur last night. Was that last night? <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Hey, well, thank you, Paula. And hello, friend, to you. I see you a lot on uh, on here. You're one of my fans. So I put a little bit of red in his ears. I'm going to put a little bit more white. Red and white. I'll put a little bit more white on this side. Leave that side dark. Leave that side dark. I hope he I hope he turns out cute, Paula. <laughs> hey, Patty. Welcome to you all. Say hi when you jump on. That helps my reach. Do you all know that? Whenever you all communicate with me, that makes other people see my stuff. Isn't that weird? The more you all interact with me, the more people see my stuff. All right. So I've just got my base, my bunny in right there, right now. Um, so I'm going to go... Y'all think I should paint the background some color, like blue, light blue or something, maybe? Or just leave it, or make it, just leave it look like wood. What do y'all think? Wood, leave it wood, or paint it a color. Paint it like a white, uh, not a whitewash, but a color o over it. What do y'all think? I'm debating. I'm not sure. I cannot decide in my head. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, stencil some letters on up here. So, I don't know. Maybe do like a... Oh, thank you, Patty. Uh, you'd leave it wood, Patty? What do you all... Anybody else have any idea? Leave it wood? And then stencil in the, the letters and then just have the bunny and the eggs and the grass. Okay. Paint it. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I really don't know what to do. So we'll just go down here to the bottom and we'll start in on that and then see what that looks like. And then we'll decide whether we're going to paint the background or not. All right. So I'm going to do some eggs. I'm going to do some eggs, I think. Do, how about, we'll do a, do some eggs. There's one. We'll do a yellow one, and then we'll do an orange one. This is similar to that other uh, painting that I had. 
do a red one. Paint it, Paula says, and Patty says to leave it plain wood. So, do we have a tiebreaker? <laughs> and then we'll do another one. We'll do a red one. Because if you have an Easter bunny, you got to have some eggs, right? I know it might have been cute if I would have done like a darker wood stain on it first. I can still do that though. Like make it look like it's brown, more of a brown, dark brown wood instead of light brown wood. I'm sure whatever you do, it will be perfect. <laughs> oh, thank you, Patty. Don't you all like the way I read? Like da, 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 da. It's because I'm looking around the corner trying to see what you guys are saying. That's hilarious. All right, so I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to put in another Easter egg. You know, February's almost over, guys. February is almost gone. Then we're going to be in March, and it's going to fly. It's going to fly. It's just crazy how time goes by so fast anymore, isn't it? It's just kooky. Seems like the older I get, the faster time goes by. Let's do this. All right, that's a little bit big, but I'll cover some of it up with the grass. And then I'm going to go back in with some light, go in with my purple, and I'm going to lighten the top of that purple guy. Just take my finger and smudge that out. <clears throat> I thought we would have some fun painting today. This just seems like a fun, fun thing. Got to have some fun every now and then. Y'all know painting's therapy, right? I say that all the time. Y'all, Do y'all believe me now? Painting is therapy. You gotta have therapy, which means you gotta paint. All right, so we're gonna go in here. But you all can do this. This is not hard, not hard at all. Not. Because I didn't do much. I just drew a circle, drew a circle, and drew a couple of ears, and down here I drew some egg shapes. So that's all I've done so far. You all can do this. I promise. No experience necessary. All right. So then I'm going to go back over here on my yellow side. I'm going to lighten the top of this egg with some white and yellow. And I'm going to lighten the top of this orange one with some orange and white. So I say, darken the bottom of it with some orange. And you could put this outside. You could seal it and put it outside, like, you know, on your porch or something. Or you could put it in your, in your house. You know, you could put it, like, uh, on your hearth or something. We're in the middle of a crazy fiasco with ours. I've got crazy, you know, stoves broken. We've got stuff laying everywhere. But when it's over with, I can put this up there and it'll look really cute. So just put in some light up at the top of this egg. So I've just got light on the top of all of them and dark down at the bottom. Rinsing, just rinsing my brush. There, drying it with a towel. All right, and then I'm going to go, let's see. Make sure I don't put that in there. I just cleaned a bunch of brushes. I'm about to get my brushes mixed up. I'm going to go in here and um, put in some details in the face, I think. Go start with my face. I'm going to do my eye. Just a little circle of white. A little circle of white. Do my nose.
So I've got, um, I posted on, on my page the other day. I've got my membership. I'm getting ready to open it back up. If any of you guys are interested in that, that is a coming. That is coming um, in uh, April. So that'll be fun. If any of you are interested in painting, learning to paint, or if you already paint and you want to learn to become better painters, that's a good one. That is a good good thing to join. It's my all-access membership. And it is closed right now. But you can um, request to get on the waiting list now. And then when it opens... You'll be on the list, and I can, um, I can, uh, invite you, uh, I'll send you an email, let you know it's open, and, uh, invite you to join, so, uh, it's, it's a, it's a really good opportunity for those who are interested in painting. Lots of stuff. I have a, a huge a library of paintings and stuff like this. You can um, see that little rough place. I knew that thing was going to get on my nerves. But it's a good place to paint, learn to paint. you got all kinds of videos to choose from. There's almost, there's like 40, 50 videos in there now. And it grows. Every month it grows and grows and grows. I'm just going to take a little bit of white, a little bit more white, so right there. Then I'm going to take a little bit of white and accent, highlight the top of my eggs. I'm going to highlight the nose. This white is not very thick white. <clears throat> All right, and then while that's drying, I'm going to come down here and put in some grass. Let's do a little bit of purple and green. Purple and green. Just do some grasses. I might have to lift that up. There we go. It's on the edge. Just pick up and Put some grass. And you all can do this. This is not hard. Um, probably the hardest part will be finding you a piece of wood. <laughs> and you can, like I said, you can get that. Um, you can make little ones out of those ones that they have over to the Walmart. They have, uh, they're back in the craft stuff. And they're on an end cap. And they're they're probably half this size. Uh, but you can make a little one. And I'm just taking my brush and just picking up some of that. Just putting that on there. I'm not being real neat about it or anything, as you can see. So I'm still trying to decide on the, the background, whether to leave it plain or to not. All right, then I'm going to take a little bit of green and my yellow and lighten some of these grasses a little bit. Green and yellow. I have a lot of parties on the, a lot of painting parties on the schedule. If you guys are interested in any of those, signing up. Don't miss out. Those are great. Got art kits. Got some art kits. I got that all doodled up there. All right. Looks like that. Uh, one purple one. It looks like it's floating a little bit. So I'm going to put some more grass underneath him a little bit. Does he look like he was floating? All right. Isn't that cute so far? So there's a little smiley Easter bunny. My other one, I gave him some 
some little teeth. I'm going to have to dry that. Hopefully, I won't lose power. Were y'all watching the laugh? I lost power one day. Goodness gracious. I think I'm going to clean my art studio today. Sometimes I do that. It's a mess and sure needs it. All right, let's see. I think this goes... I'll do a little... Uh, there. This brush that I grabbed is not the best brush in the world. Oh, my gosh. It's like fuzzies. It has little fuzzies on it. I don't like that at all. Get some more black. Just going into some black. How do you like that messy palette? That's a good one, isn't it? And we'll do some little eyebrows. Draw that again. All righty. Then we're going to... Oh, I think I'm going to shade him a little bit more over here. So that looks like he's got a neck or a head. Put a little bit out there. I don't like the white that I'm using. It's yucky. Soften that a little bit. But that gave it a little bit of a turn. Okay. All right. Then, let's see. How about... I'm gonna, the other one I had a little bow on is... Uh, a little bow on his neck, but I don't think I'm going to put a bow on this one. Do y'all think I need, he needs a bow? Do y'all think he needs a bow? What do you think? Bow or no bow? I cannot find my brushes. I got a little look, little place right there where I need to clean. No bow. Okay. Thank you, Patty. <laughs> I love it, love it, love it when you guys give me ideas because sometimes it's hard to decide. And of course, I'm, I paint by myself a good bit. And when you guys help me, there's that. Put a little bit of a light. Make his eye a little bit darker. Put a little bit of a darker around there. Put a little light in his eye. Let's see. Like that. No bow. Lights in his eyes. All right. Well, how about that? Is that good? And then, while I'm going to do some stencils, and I'm going to um, 
make it say, what do you say? Happy Easter or something like that? You think Happy Easter would be good? Did we decide on a no background, yes or no? No background? Don't know? Doesn't matter? All right. Well, there's that. Hey, that's a good start on it anyways. So what I'll do is I'll come up with a stencil uh, that we can do, and that'll be an experience uh, on these little cracks. And then we'll um, decide on the background. How about that? Yay! Bunny. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Well, that was a fun project for today. Did you all think? <laughs> Funny, fun, bun, fun bunny project. So, thank you all for joining. Oh, you think it should say Happy Easter, Sandy? Uh, you and Patty? Yeah, I, I think that would be cute. Happy Easter. And then, like I said, I'm not sure um, what I was thinking about the background or the back. Like, see, and here's the way the back was put together, the way my husband did that. He just took um, the, uh, I'll show you what I'm talking about, painting the board on the back. Um, but he just took these boards, and of course he did. He does everything real heavy duty. Um, I don't know why he um, he always goes the extra mile. Where in the world is my brown paint? Do y'all know I need to clean this mess up in here because it's a wreck. Okay, and I know that's trying to like focus in and out again, and I apologize for that. It does that down here. Okay, here's what I was talking about, the background. Ugh. Now that's all moved. And this is backwards, so that drives me insane. So here's what I do, is I take a little bit of paint. This is another lesson of, of sorts. I take a little bit of paint, and I add some water to it. I have to get some clean water. That water is uh, green. I don't want green water. So I take a little bit of water, <clears throat> and I water my, I water my paint down, Hoppy Easter. Now, that would be cute, um, but I water my paint down, and it makes it, like, real liquid, like this, kind of like a wash, and then when you're working with, like, plain wood like this, you can just go over it, and see it just darkens the wood, so we can do that to the front, so it makes it look like a dark, a little bit dark. And see, there's the plain. So do y'all like the dark or do you like the plain? I kind of like the dark. So it would be like that. Of course, these little thingies aren't on the front. But all he did is he, is he took the um, pieces of wood and then he... Um, I screwed them on there with that. So y'all think background, no background, or, um, and then, or I could take like a light blue. Let's see what light blue looks like. I could take that uh, blue, get a little bit of water in my blue, make it a wash, and see what blue looks like. And there would be a blue, well, I got some brown in my paint. And there would be a blue wash on the wood. So we could do like a darker, a darker brown, a light, um, or a blue, or um, leave it plain. So, I don't know. I'm liking the dark. Y'all have a vote? I think I'm going to do the dark. I think. Is what I'm going to do. Alright. I'm rinsing my brush. And I am going to do the dark. I've got to get my plate ready. And that may screw it up completely. But you know, the beauty of it is, is I can do it again another day. <laughs> do it again another day, right? Are y'all scared? 
can't do it. You can't be afraid. You just got to do it. You just got to paint and paint afraid. <clears throat> I say that. Because a lot of people are afraid to do stuff and uh, afraid they'll mess something up. But sometimes you just got to paint and paint afraid. And don't worry about stuff. It's just wood. Go back and get some more. Actually, this was scraps. I can't remember what he was making. Actually, I think he was making my shelf for the art studio. I like that. Y'all like that? I do. Uh, and all I did was took the, the brown, watered down my paint, and put barely anything on my paintbrush and painting it on there. Um, but he made some shelves for me for my art studio. And uh, this was leftover paint. Well, this was a fun uh, Saturday. Uh, is today Saturday? <laughs> a fun Saturday project. I don't even know what day it is anymore. All right. So, y'all want to do more stuff like this? Is this fun? Do you all like this kind of thing? Or do you? Uh, I do. I like um, just different projects. And I'm dampening my, I'm getting it in the water. If you're wondering what I'm doing. I'm getting it in here and I have a paper towel down here by my side. I'm going into the water and then I'm kind of daubing it on my paper towel. And then I'm going back in and painting it on. And it's really mostly... Uh, it's just a watered-down paint. It's just a watered-down um, paint. Brown. Burn Umber. And I'm glad that I used that instead of the blue. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. All right. I covered up that bad place. There was like a marker there. I don't know what that was from. Probably where I had it over there on my thing. Yeah, I like that. Okay. That's pretty cool. Anything I just need to darken up his so he'll show up a little bit. Just darken him up right there a little bit. So he shows up more. That's cute. That is cute. Can you all see it? I moved it around. There we go. So it's not so white anymore. Then I'll go in and I'll stencil that, get a stencil, and we'll stencil that on next time. How about that? So that's cute. And I think Hoppy Easter would be good. Okay. That's cute. All right. Well, thank you all for joining in with me today on this fun project. <laughs> And thank you so much for your input. Um, I, I appreciate that. That was fun. So we'll have to do that again sometime. All righty. Well, thank you all. Uh, God bless you all and take care. And uh, I'll see you back on here again sometime real soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.